What's going on my Cardano friends? It's your friend Jack here and in today's video we're going to be talking about buying a house and achieving financial freedom using Cardano and cryptocurrency in general. Now I've talked about this a million times before and I'm going to continue talking about it because it's something that still resonates with me and is in my head every single day. So sharing my thoughts with you most recently is kind of fun for both of us. We can benefit, we can have some fun and talk about financial freedom and just how I plan to buy a house with Cardano or with cryptocurrency in general because realistically what I'm doing right now is operating a small business using Cardano. A stake pool is similar to small business. You receive income from a stake pool paid in ADA, have to pay taxes on it. To me it's a business but my plan is to essentially get to the point where I don't have to worry about you know money too much right now I'm very fortunate to have the YouTube income which is helping me a ton but I want to get to the point where I can create any YouTube videos I can do whatever I want and you know build on Cardano and keep building without having to worry about any of that stuff and also I want to be able to get a house for myself so my plan is to stack Cardano for the next year two years three years depends how long it could take longer um, while the price appreciates and get more Cardano get more of these other coins and cryptocurrencies inside the ecosystem of Cardano that I really have a lot of beliefs in that are cheap now and use some of those profits very small amount to buy a house in the next five years that's my plan I don't plan on selling 100% if anything I just sell a fraction of my basically crypto bags I wouldn't sell all of them I wouldn't sell majority I probably just sell uh, you know a decent amount and that's the point of stacking Cardano is I plan to get to the point where I can buy a house and still have enough left over to earn interest off of and just continue to hold it accumulate it and not have to worry about too much day-to-day -to -day bills because in the end at the end of the day we're all looking for the same thing we all don't want to worry about that money part of life and it is a big part of life money can't buy you happiness but it can solve your money problems and that is the goal that most people probably watching this video are trying to solve we're trying to get past that money problem get to the other problems in life right so you can focus on the happiness equation all the other things more meticulously more precisely and that's my plan i plan on accumulating Cardano with my stake pool and buying it every single week as long as well as also buying some other altcoins in the Cardano ecosystem Ergo, Singularity Net, and Romobo token are my main three and using some of the capital gains from those at some point to buy myself a house outright to set myself up for essentially the rest of my life within my 20s I'm only 21 right now and many of you already know kind of all these plans but I like putting in a video out there so I can look back so someone can look on the internet and say hey this person they're doing something that I also want to do and um I'm just a guy in my mom's basement maybe I'm wrong and crypto goes to zero but the risk to me seems very very minuscule compared to the potential reward to me it feels like a 90 10 almost and the 90% is me having enough money to buy a house outright and also having a lot left over in the end after five years. That's the 90% that I see myself in because of the conviction I have in blockchain technology and cryptocurrencies being a part of a better future. So if you don't believe in cryptocurrencies and you have no conviction in them, I suggest you probably don't invest in cryptocurrencies. That's all I got to say. And if you want conviction in them, you want to see why they're valuable, do your own research. As odd as that is to say, go on the internet, find people you like, find people who you want to put your trust in and see what their opinions are. And then form your own opinions. Uh, think critically and think a lot because these things aren't super easy to get your head around either. But reading books, listening to podcasts and things like that about crypto and blockchains are going to get you caught up to speed and honestly once you read books and listen to blockchain podcasts it's going to be pretty hard to stay on the other side of the fence of crypto land where you're looking down on it because once you're in it you are freaking in it and that's all i gotta say for today my plan is to be in it stay in it hold my crypto make and then just 
when it you know reaches a couple million bucks you know use some of it to buy a house right outright that's pretty freaking cool maybe that doesn't happen maybe it does right but i think it will i think it will and if it doesn't i'm not going to be too upset about it um it's going to be disappointing maybe a bit but i'll get over it and this risk that i'm taking i want to share with you over and over again i want to just discuss that everyone building blockchain technology or building a business or career around it is taking uh you know a risk but to me it doesn't feel like that much of a risk it feels like the choice that i just happen to fall into and i wouldn't have it any other way honestly anyways hope you enjoyed this video i plan on buying a house outright with cryptocurrencies in the next five years that's the gist of it using cardano and cardano related cryptocurrencies i'm also going to be investing pretty much a hundred percent of my fiat currency that isn't for taxes or rent or utilities for the long term for five ten years more i'm going to be stacking cryptocurrency as much as i can as much as i can and that's my plan I'm not a financial advisor just a guy in his mom's basement but i like sharing my plan with you guys hope you guys enjoyed see you guys in the next video peace out once again